Hello everyone, so if you know me well enough, you know that I am a massive geography nerd. Like, that's something I probably do a little too much in my free time, is just look at maps. I genuinely think maps are, like, one of the best forms of wall decoration you can, you can like, get ever. I have, like, seven, seven of them on my walls. Do you, uh, do you mind? It's a bit ballsy, but a bit stupid as well. Same thing for you. That was not very smart i'll be real anyway so if you know me you know that i'm a massive geography nerd like i love maps so much like i, I could actually sit there and look at map look at a map for like way longer than i'd like to admit but so so i and i'm a senior in high school so it's kind of like my last year kind of senior i just do whatever you want and i i wanted to take ap geography for the longest time um like i play i i tried to not apply but like i I signed up for the class like freshman year, no, not freshman year, but let's let me take care of this guy. Really? You guys all decide to fight me at the exact same time? I mean, I'll, I'll take all these free kills, like, I, I won't complain. But anyway, so I've been, I've been trying to get this class since 10th grade. This is the first year you can take it. Um, it's pretty much like a class for 10th graders exclusively, but um, a lot of 11, a few 11th graders take it that pants had something on it. Oh, I thought this pants had something. Um, but a, a few 11th graders take it, but hardly any seniors take it. And I signed up for it this year as my priority like elective, you know? And I, I, I got it, which is... I, like, I don't know why they didn't let me in the first time. Okay, so like... Pretty much last year, I had the choice between AP Site and AP Geo. Now, I'm not in, I'll be honest, I know a lot of people are really interested in psychology. I'm not, just not interested in it at all. Like, I, I really don't care that much about psychology. It's, it's cool being able to, like, kind of tell, like, differences between people's emotions, like, how the brain works and everything. I, I do find quite a bit of interest in kind of how it operates. And that was a cool part of, uh, of psychology that I took, and it was pretty enjoyable. But, I didn't sign up. For, I didn't even sign up for the class. It wasn't even on my, like, elective list. I have no clue why they gave it to me. I mean, the only reason I can think of is because, like, I don't know, it, maybe my class has interfered uh, with, like, why did I go up that way? I'm kind of kind of special. I'm actually going to get this one first. But maybe, like, my other class has interfered with it, which, I mean, that's definitely a possibility, and I, I can't, you know. They, they, I guess they maybe tried to put me in APGO, but do you mind? I'm trying to have a conversation here. Um, but maybe they tried to like put me in APGO, but it just didn't work out because my other class interfered with it. But um, anyways, nonetheless, I got it this year. So it's not like any of that even matters. I, I got a decent grade on the AP exam for psych, so I'm not complaining. Um, but, you know, I, I went into APGO like thinking it was going to be such a cool class, learning how to learn about all this stuff. I don't... I went into APGO thinking it was going to be like a super cool class, and to be completely fair, um, the material is pretty cool. Like, cool being it makes me not want to commit mass arson, which is fairly rare in terms of humanities classes like that. Don't know what that guy was trying. I mean, he splashed me with poison. I'm not entirely sure what that was doing toward his goal of killing me. Like, it's done a total zero hearts of damage so far. Oh, it went to a half a heart just for a second. All right, you know. Applauding him. I, I applaud that guy. He really got super far in his uh, endeavors. But anyways, um, so I went into that class thinking it was going to be super cool, cool. And to be fair, the material isn't that bad. But there's something about it, like the way that the people teaching that class hold themselves. It's really cringe. Like, the, the material is really easy. I'll be completely honest with you. Like, it's a super easy class. I don't really want to die to this guy. There we go. I kind of was expecting that, honestly. Like, I, I get that, like, geography can be really, um, like, really in-depth, and there's a lot to explore in, like, the culture part. Um, but for just, like, a surface-level class, like most AP classes are, you can't really expect the class material to be that hard, and I think that's why it's meant for, like, 10th graders. Are you actually coming over? Huh. Yeah, that was a... Quite an awful idea, I'll be real with you.
Um, but like, it, there isn't really too much I can expect out of it. I mean, the 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 entire reason that I took it anyways is because it would be a pretty fairly easy AP class, and um, I thought it'd be fairly enjoyable for me just because of my interests. But little did I know that it would not be fun at all. Most OP strat in the book. Look, that guy just didn't. He he couldn't do anything about that. Okay, so. I've been saying that the bat guy kid is OP for a long time. Like usually, you'd like to um, you'd like to wait and use it on like the last stack person because the thing is, uh, there's so many times it's like you can't get to mid that quickly and then you just get unlucky because everyone else gets stacked. But if you use that potion, then they literally can't see, and so like they just they get combos. Ah, okay, I will take that kill. I also want. This kill. Wow, that was... I kind of feel bad for that guy, honestly. Did he say anything? No, he didn't. Okay. He's being chill about it. So as I said, the, the class material really is just not difficult in the slightest. Like, to be completely fair to them, it is meant for, like, 10th graders. And um, the thing about geography is that it's just such an enormous topic. Like, you, you just cannot teach high schoolers the, the details about every single culture in the world. That's just... I mean, just tried to easily bridge. I mean, I respect it. Ah, that was lucky. That was lucky too. Okay. You know what? I'll let you live. That's fine. You deserve it. Um, but yeah, you, you really just can't teach a bunch of 10th graders about every single culture in the entire world because that's just not how that works. Too large of a topic. Um, so, it, honestly, anyone who has, like, a decent grasp on geography and, like, who is a bit of a geography nerd can probably make a good grade on it without even taking the class. A good grade on the exam. Probably like a three. That's not a great grade. Where's this guy's going in? That was pretty ballsy. I respect it, but wasn't very smart. Um, so, and that's not my problem with the class. Like, I was kind of expecting it to be an easy class with um, all things considered. But what really annoys me about the class and why I don't like it at all is because... It, okay, so it's like, you know, it's a fairly, fairly simple topic. You know, it's, as I said, it's too broad to really be represented. I'm just in the middle of everyone. I'm not actually going to uh, mess with any of you guys. I'm just going to leave if that's okay with all of you. There you go. That's what I like to see. Steal a kill. Steal a kill. Come on. Come on. Evan. There we go. Actually, I actually still, uh, I'm sorry. I... I'm sorry. I feel bad now because I, I really don't d deserve that kill in the slightest. Um, but and again, my problem is not that the class is too easy because I was expecting that. My problem with it is that they act like it's the most difficult class in the world. Like, okay, so and I'm I'm saying this about not just about my teacher because uh, you could make the argument that it's just one teacher. You know, maybe there's one teacher's. I'll be honest, my teacher's like really passive aggressive. Um, letting this guy get some armor because, like, why not? I kind of did not deserve that last kill in the slightest. I'm just going to go ahead and kill off his pets because pets aren't allowed here. Yeah. This is the most OP strat, by the way. Because he can't run anymore, and therefore it'll be really easy to get combos on him. Like, I didn't even have to try there, like, at all. The game... Um, but I'll, I'll try to replicate like her level of passive aggressiveness really quick. It's honestly, it's like subtle enough so that it's hard to replicate. Um, but it's also like it's there. You can tell it's there if you're talking to her like really easily. Um, but like, okay, so we've been online uh, since since March just because of the whole coronavirus thing. It just isn't ideal. Oh, I, was, I just got lag back on those carpets. Why? Did, why are they there? I'm mildly confused but whatever um but so we, we've been online since march i think i said um and so we get on like zoom calls and stuff you know probably as basically everyone else is doing outside of like maybe europe or actually europe's been pretty bad recently so i wouldn't be surprised if they got if they had to be online kind of want to oh shoot i just killed that man um but like, okay, so let's say there's someone in the in the call who isn't really participating, who like maybe has their camera off or something like that, because we're 
we're supposed to have our cameras on um, during class. But but she'll say stuff like, uh, yeah, class, I'm sorry, but we're, we're just waiting for this person to turn their camera on. You can just help. You can just feel the passive aggressiveness oozing. It's it's cursed. I, I'm not sure how well I did like to, to imitate that passive aggressiveness, but it's definitely there. Pull out. Okay. Don't exactly know what that means. I just realized I still don't have a chest plate. That's quite unfortunate. Hello. Actually, I'm going to leave. Thank you for letting me participate, but I don't want to be here. Just like mostly because of my lack of chest plate. Hello. What are you? Do you mind? Do you mind? Uh, do you mind, sir? Why are they both aggressing me, but they're not aggressing each other? That's kind of cringe. Uh, they're aggressing each other. Never mind. Yeah, there we go. I do have a knockback rod, but I kind of don't really want to use it all that much. Um, but yeah, hopefully I kind of replicated that passive aggressiveness. Um, but it you could usually you could just chalk that up to, oh, well, this teacher kind of sucks, blah, 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 whatever. The thing is, is... Okay, so as I said, we're online. And AP is making these videos for us, like these daily AP videos. Pretty ballsy, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, go back in there. I'll take my, my chests. Ooh, yes, that is literally exactly what I needed. Thank you, Chess. Okay, that's a uh, that's that's enough. I can, I, I got it. It's okay. <laughs> Don't need four chess plates. I'm alright. I just need need one. Um, so a AP makes these videos for us that my teacher assigns us to watch. You know, for like homework or whatever, so that we come back the next class day and we're ready for ready to be taught or whatever. I understand that. I understand that. That's um like a, I actually think that's a pretty cool way. Like a pretty good way of teaching is kind of let the kids study the material on their own before do you mind before like class actually starts gaming too much hello peek peek i don't know why this guy's like close range bowing he just go in for melee right now and it's like have you have you or did you just like okay See, look how OP that... I mean, that guy wasn't exactly the most competent player, but, like, look how OP that potion was. And so these, like, these AP videos that I was talking about, all of the teachers that make them are the exact same. Like, they're not... Like, obviously, they're not the exact same person, but they all... Is that guy? It straight up looked like he was B-hopping there. I mean, I guess he's not... He's definitely not B-hopping. I guess he was just laggy, because he is very laggy. That was really weird. He just actually looked like he was be hopping up to that chest, just like no shame. I mean, I respect it, but I respect the uh, respect the the no shame. Um, but like all of those teachers, they they all kind of carry themselves the same way. They all talk the same way. It it seems like they're all fairly passive aggressive. And if you jump, there's this joke um, that people used to say all the time: if you jump from their ego to their IQ, then you die. Because, you know, the egos are really big and the IQ is really lower. You know, that's kind of the idea of the joke. But they all they all actually seem that way. Did I kill him like that? No, I didn't. Okay. Um, and it's not like that with all the AP videos because I, I'm taking AP Lit as well. And my teacher does the same thing. She assigns us AP videos to watch for homework as well. Those, like, AP Daily videos. Um, and the people are there are, like, really chill. Like, there's this one guy especially... Uh, he seemed like a pretty big nerd. Like, he seemed like a chill nerd, you know? See, look how OP that potion is. It's crazy. He just he just had the inability to run. Come back for more. Don't know why that guy came in at that exact second. That was a horrible second to come in. So it's like these AP teachers, they got their they got their AP class and they're all like super happy now, but 
then the thing is is that their ego spikes because their class is now an AP class. And it's not like the material is any harder because when something becomes an AP class, it gets an AP test, but it probably doesn't really, the material doesn't really get much harder just because obviously it's still the same material. Um, so it's like their ego spiked for no reason. Let's see you. That was a weird situation. I did not want to be over there. Hello. What is up? Uh, there's multiple people eyeing us up. I'm not entirely convinced you wanna you wanna continue with this battle. But so as I said, it's not like the course material gets any more difficult. It's just the teachers get a larger ego, um, and so they teach the material like they have like the material is the most difficult thing on earth. And it's like they threw in some buzzword vocabulary words. It's the stupidest thing ever. Like so, there's this one vocabulary word that I had. Um, like, obviously, we had to, like, remember and stuff. It's called the, like, the time-space prism. You know, it sounds like we're learning, like, theoretical physics. We're, like, exploring string theory in 12 different dimensions. No. We're literally just talking about, like, it, it's something stupid, like, the time and space in which all of the activities that you and I do lies within. It's so dumb. And there are a bunch of them like that, too, because you have the words, like, place and like culture and i don't know like i mean more specific words than that but those are a couple examples and then you just have time space prism or like stupid like there are a couple words like that they're so stupid it's like it's like once they got an ap class they they decided okay our, our material is too easy so we just have to make stupid buzzwords that mean actually nothing so that our class can be taken seriously but Every time I look at those words, it just makes me burst out laughing because it's so dumb. I think a good comparison, if you've ever taken AP Psych before, is AP Geo is basically AP Psych, but with a massive ego. Like, they use a bunch of big words that they don't know the meaning of. They they all think they're that they know it all. They're actually... I don't know. I, as I said, I don't have any problem with the, like the course material at all. It's actually pretty interesting. Um, but... It's just the the teachers and some of the stuff is just so cringe. Uh, it's awful. Um, so I don't know. I, I have like a couple more like a couple more months of it. I'm obviously just gonna truck through it. It's really not that bad. Yeah, see that guy got scared of my my blindness pot. It's OP. I'm telling you. Like, the class is just really annoying. I, I don't know how to explain it. It's just cringe. That's the only way I can explain it. It's just cringe. Um, so, hopefully I'll be done with that fairly soon. It's, it's really not that bad of a class. It's just it's, it's just cringe. It's not, like, boring or anything. It's just, it's just cringe. Um, also, another thing is that the teacher takes a really, really long time to say everything. And I think that it kind of goes back to, like, them seeming like they have too big of an ego. All right, what are we uh, what are we doing here, Daddy Pina? A weird champ name, if you ask me. There we go. So yeah, I I guess I'm just gonna like take the exam, see how it goes, um, see what type of score I can get. It, it's okay. So it's a really if you're thinking about taking it, it's an insanely easy class. If first of all you know anything about geography, like if you know where things are and kind of the, the general culture of each place. I really want your stuff. Please come over. No, I didn't get your stuff. That's cringe. Um, ooh, that's pretty clean, actually. Unfortunately, I did not get their uh, your stuff. Ooh, I want your stuff, actually. Ooh, I, did I actually... I. I lost the leggings from that guy too, did I? My favorite. Um, but yeah, if you're wanting to take it, it's a really easy class if you know anything about geography and if you know how to take AP tests. So like, if you've taken an AP test before and you know like how to take them, then it's a really easy class, honestly. There's a guy behind you. There's a guy behind you. There's a guy, there's a man currently chasing after you, sir. There it is. Okay, there you go. I'll just let those two fight. Oh, I don't want to be... Shoot. Okay. Hello. Hello. 
You gonna come down? You gonna come down? I have my secret weapon. Ooh, he hit me from there? <laughs> Jeez, that must have been some crazy lag. As long as you know like how to do those two things, then it's really not a, a hard class to take at all. Like, You'll probably get like a 90 at least in it, 95 if you know things about geography beforehand, and you'll probably get like 4 or 5 on it. I mean, I haven't taken the AP exam yet, but based on the, amount, based on the type of questions that we're answering right now, it's really not looking like it's going to be the most difficult thing in the world. So, yeah, if, if you... If you can manage those two things, and then you'll you'll be fine in that class. Uh, pretty easy AP class. Make you look good if you get a get a four or five on it. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, this is basically just me ranting about my dislike of that class for I'm actually not sure how long. Um, but hope you guys could relate to it just a little bit. I hope I don't scare you off the class just because it it really is a pretty cool class if you're into that if you're into geography and stuff. But it's a little cringe sometimes, so anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and bye. They want a story, I'ma tell them that. They want to see I got the visions, want the change, I'll make the difference. And you know that I'll be searching till I bring it back. Yeah, I went through hell and back to find myself, but I am not the same as who I left, no. I am not the same, I'm reinventing from the head toe. Still, I'm on that same mold. Still, I'm grinding just to reach the payroll. Since I was like, yay, Tyler, yay, oh.